My name is Ben Speckhard, and this is my story. I was born and I grew up on a farm in Missouri, and I was raised my whole life as a Christian. In fact, most people in my family were Christians, my parents, my grandparents, my cousins, and I was baptized at a young age. But despite growing up that way, my faith was not really my own until I became a teenager. Uh, and I say that not to mean that I wasn't a Christian before, I was, uh, but I really had a childlike faith. Uh, and so it was maybe a little bit obligatory, and it was simple, and it was untested like it would be uh, later on when, of course, things got much, much more complex. Uh, and so the summer before my freshman year of high school, I attended a Christ in Youth conference in Carbondale, Illinois with my church. And it was a great event, but it wasn't until the last night when all of the young men in our group uh, broke apart and we sat down in the middle of a parking lot at midnight and we began to discuss and uh, uh, to confess to one another all of the sin and the struggles and the junk in our lives. And in that place, I felt the true uh, sense of God. I felt the presence of God for the first time. And later on that night in the dorms where we were staying, I asked a good friend to pray with me, and I gave my heart to Jesus. Uh, and I consider that to be the point when I really took responsibility for my faith, when it went from being just something I was doing or I was used to believing without much thought to a real, personal, conscious decision uh, to serve the Lord and to live my life for Him. And that has changed everything since. Uh, you know, I consider myself very fortunate to have had a Christian upbringing, and I consider myself fortunate to have the life that I have now. Um, but like everybody, to one degree or another, I've been through trials and temptations, and I've been many places uh, when I was scared or alone uh, or angry or I didn't know what to do. Um, and, you know, I've, I've been through multiple divorces in my family and broken relationships. Um, I am in the Army. I've been deployed to Afghanistan, and I've lived all over on my own. And on top of it all, I am still a sinner, and I have struggles every day. Uh, but, but in all those moments, and even all of the, the trivial, mundane moments in between, whether I knew it at the time or I discovered it later, I have seen God move in my life, and so He's changed everything. Uh, he has changed my outlook on life, He's changed my priorities, He's changed uh, my marriage and relationships and the way that I interact with and love other people, uh, and uh, He is continuing to, to, to build me into something new and better, um, and has shown me grace and mercy uh, that I do not deserve and that I cannot comprehend. Uh, and so he is the reason uh, for the hope that I have deep in my heart and my soul uh, for this life and for the next.